Hey everybody, Jim Phillips here. Welcome to Java with Jim. I appreciate you being here and giving me a few minutes of your time. Sorry about the noise in the background. I appreciate you giving me a few minutes of your time. I want to answer a question that was asked of me a couple of days ago. And this really is more or less a follow-up to the last video I did where I was talking about the fact that a lot of people don't feel or for whatever their reasons, they 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 believe that people who are engaged in the type of business I am, writing, speaking on, on spiritual topics and uh, doing presentations, anything that would be about self-improvement. They had questioned whether or not someone like me and others, we actually go through life with really none of the challenge everybody else has. Well, I answered that question and absolutely yes we do. Everybody just doesn't see it. Well, the other question that I was asked, and this was in response to that was, and I'm just going to read what I wrote down. Do I have days when I feel less, excuse me, do I have days when I feel less optimistic and challenged? Well, of course I do. There are many days I'll wake up in the morning and I don't want to get out of bed. Again, just like everybody else has. And when I feel that way, it depends on how I'm actually feeling because there are some days I'm just looking for bear. And I know that if I engage with anybody, I'm going to create a situation that I, I don't want to be engaged in. I'm going to create some drama, something that perhaps I'll say something or do something that I'll, I'll have some regret around. But then the question is, well, how do I move through that? Well, sometimes I don't. Sometimes I just allow myself to be in those feelings, to just whatever it is. And it, it can be anything that could have triggered it. it. I don't know what, I can't think of an example right now, but anything that puts me in, in, a, in a frame of mind, a state of mind where I don't feel like I'm, I'm being my best, I typically won't engage with people because I want to make sure that when I am engaged, that I am my best, that I am connecting with them on the highest level possible, that both of us are connecting with one another on the highest level possible. And certainly if I'm doing work with people to help them overcome their challenges, I don't want to be in the midst of my own personal challenge and try to help them work through theirs. I'm just not going to be at my optimal best. So the first thing I do is allow myself to have the feelings. I just let them out. I let them, I let them out as fully and completely as I possibly can. I also know that I am the one that can control the feelings and emotions that I'm having. I can either allow them to come through and be played out, or I can get myself out of the feelings, out of the emotions, and put myself into a higher state of mind. And I do that by thinking of those things that truly bring me joy, or not even just thinking about something that truly brings me joy, do something that truly brings me joy that will lift me out of whatever the funk is that I might be in that day. And sometimes it is simply having a conversation with somebody. I could get a call from somebody and they ask me a question. We engage in a conversation and that makes me feel better about, about myself because that's typically what it's about when I'm feeling down or any of us are feeling down. It's about us. It's not about other people. So the, the, the long answer to the question is yes, I do have days when I'm less optimistic. I have days when I'm feeling extremely challenged, but because I'm aware of the fact that all of these circumstances that are put in my path are for my benefit, I'm always looking for the benefit. I look for the gain. I try to get it as quickly as I can so I don't allow myself to wallow in whatever the emotions might be that I'm experiencing at that particular point in time. Hope this is helpful. Look forward to talking to you again. Until next time, take care and be well. Bye now.